Damn. Oh my god. Okay, so we're we're in. It just started, I guess. I'll save you. You missed. Oh, oh! I can fold you up real quick. It ain't even a problem for me. It ain't even a problem. Look at that teamwork, man. Let's go. Oh no! Just the sound of the water, bro. Like I can just tell this is gonna be annoying as hell. All right. Anyways, jungle only. I am using a, a secret seed, and it looks like all the stone blocks are replaced with hive blocks. So that's gonna be like the first challenge. We just need to find some trees. Like, I'm not, I'm not sure where the trees are at. A uh, tree, yes. Now I should probably mention this is on normal mode, just so I can get the video out sooner. However, to combat that, I made sure to triple the enemy spawn rate. You know, to make it more interesting, I guess. I, I really shouldn't have done that. Yeah, so uh, every time one bat spawns, uh, three of them will spawn. <laughs> okay, no, actually, we need to we need to do something. This is not good. This is really not good. Uh, jump you. Get your ass back here, boy. Relax. <laughs> yeah, but for this challenge, uh, jungle gear only, which means jungle weapons only, jungle accessories only, and jungle armor only. So I started to gear up. I went through the ooh, exploring processes, headed underground, but it was short-lived. Okay, bro, I'm gonna start work on a house, bro. Cause I wanna be able to, if I die, I need, I need somewhere to go. So I'm gonna get like a nice little structure going. Well, that's what I thought anyways, but the tripled enemy spawn rates combined with the enemy spawn rates in the jungle were too much for me. Nah, genuinely, this is this is actually crazy. I couldn't even get the wood to build my house. Bro, it was just massacre after massacre. God, being chased down by bats, little viney critters trying to grab me. However, one good thing did come out of this, knowledge. There's, there's bees in the trees? Yo, they just killed the bat, though. What the hell? Wait, bees can kill, like, enemies? Hold up. We might be able to use that, actually. After being completely massacred during the night. Oh, oh! Mm. Stop! Get out of my- I decided to camp out in my house and wait until morning. All right, well, the guide's dead. But daytime is coming. The enemies are leaving. This is looking good for us. Bro, they don't even go away during daytime. And then me, Mr. Genius over here, went to make a graveyard biome so I get the Abigail's flower. Thought that would help me out, right? Didn't even realize it's not a jungle weapon, so I can't even use it. Well, actually, that's not a jungle weapon. Never mind. I'm gonna create a graveyard biome. I'm gonna create a graveyard biome. <sighs> but once I got the loot from this chest, everything was about to change. Oh, yo, hook me up, brother. Well, not that chest. This one. Ooh. Oh, I need this chest so bad. Yes. A shotgun. Let's go. I don't... I don't have any ammo. Hey, bro. Now that we got a weapon, I just need to get the arms dealer in here. Build some more... Some NPC housing. And we are set, bro. We are set up to start. I'm gonna go collect some wood and then make a nice little starting house right here. Seriously? Like, really? Alright, I think this is a nice solid frame for the house. Fit like two to three NPCs. Hey, arms dealer. Yo. Let me get some ammo, buddy. Okay, yeah. We're cooking. Also, I can already make the jungle hat. So, boom. Upgrade. Now we're gonna be unstoppable. Yo, I am shredding these mobs. Oh my god. But having a good weapon will save you from everything. I'm so dead. I'm dead. No, but oh my god. I must have got so many, like, so many things from that. Materials. Died a few times. Okay. Hey, but we were getting upgrades. Oh, wait, cobalt leggings. Hold up. Hey, we only need one more piece of jungle gear, then we got the full set. Swam in some honey, had some honey fights. Bro. Learned about the uh, accuracy of my weapon. No, the accuracy on the shotgun is insane. <laughs> Has some bees coming after me. Oh. Oh! And then this. Oh my god, bro. Look how many there are in there. Oh my gosh. Let me just throw a quick glow stick. Damn! Wait, these spawn in the jungle? Alright, that's uh, it's fair use then. More deaths. Ooh, caught myself. <laughs> More honey. Heart crystal! I am submerged in honey. More struggling. Ugh. Hey, but we were looting up. Yup, yup! Woo! And I ended my expedition. Oh, I almost opened that. With a bang. Nobody really starting to piss me off. I'll take both of us out. Okay, I've died enough. What can we make? 
Oh, first I want the whip. Oh, yeah. Damn, bro. I'm all out of spores and everything. Bro, that's crazy. I gotta, I gotta go back down there again. You know what's weird, though? This is a mage set, but I don't think there's a single mage item you get from the jungle. It's all like ranger stuff for melee. Yeah, but I think we're just gonna use this setup right here to kill Queen Bee. I'm gonna get a couple extra accessories, and then we're ready. All right, yeah, I'll, I'll be back once I got enough for something. After some quick gearing up, got the anchor of the wind, collected some heart crystals, possibly cheated. She, I mean, this isn't technically the jungle, but I'm gonna take it. And we found a queen's nest. All right, I found a beehive. Found many, but I think this is the one we're gonna fight. Gotta be a little bit careful. Bro, look how many are out there. This must be my arena. I think we're just fighting her in here then. All right, here we go. This is classic mode, so it shouldn't be too hard. Oh yeah, she's taking a lot of damage already. I'm joking. Ah, 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 ah. Oh, get me out of the honey. What the? F is your problem. I'm like, yo, hit the enemy, bro. Wait, what are you doing? My character is throwing. Oh my. I don't know how a cockroach got in here, but let's go. First boss out the way. All right. All right, but we're going to need to fight another one of those queen bees. So we get the full, like, summoning set with, with all this bee wax or whatever. And spam some of these around. That's my arena. Stop. Bro, who's going to carry the boats? And there we go. Anyway, after the fight, I decided to pop okay. some random teleportation potions, and we found this. Hey, climbing claws. We actually, we're gonna need these. Yeah, so you're probably wondering, like, why would I need climbing claws? And that's because there's something about this challenge I didn't tell you. For this challenge, there is going to be no wings. Not allowed, okay? The spirit of the challenge is to play as Tarzan. And you know, Tarzan isn't flying around. He's swinging from vine to vine, jumping around, using his surroundings, and using wings would just go against the spirit of the challenge. If you saw my no wings video, I think this was the best strategy, and you know exactly what I'm about to do. If you haven't, you just gotta wait. Wait, there's a bee yo yo? Alright, make that. And then I think there's also like a jungle whip I can make. Hey. Hey, we're going with summoner. Hornet staff. Boom. Two, that's it. Oh no, I just don't have any mana. Come on. Three. Let's go. After getting my new armor set, I decided it was time to start making more houses, improving my base. I built some interesting designs, but I think they look pretty good, honestly. I'm trying to get like a jungly feel to it. Alright, that's gonna have to be a chimney. I'm not getting rid of that. But then slime started raining from the sky. Oh, bro. So I had to start work on my new arena for King Slime. Alright, I didn't have time to build my arena, but uh, I guess I'll just start right now. Bro, what are the chances? All right, anyways, we gotta, we gotta go back down. Gotta hit the wall just in time. Boom! Okay, I totally... I know I touched that wall. Yeah. Boom! All right, anyways, next pillar. Bro, they're nailing these guys up the sky, bro. All right, we got our climbing claw arena basically... Basically done. Whoa. All right, let's jump to the other side. Woo! Bro, fighting King Slime in this arena is gonna be very interesting. I don't have any jumping accessories either, except the stool. To help me out. Uh, bro, who, whose grave is this? Probably like a in-game bug or something. Oh, yo, we got the grapple too. I, I completely forgot. Oh, my slime boss spawn. Spawn man. Oh, bro, look at us. Oh, yo, the witch doctor sells the pygmy necklace already. I did not know that. I'll be taking one of those. Take off the stool. Yo, it's actually so good. I don't know if that's a mod or if that's normal, but... I'll take it. Slime, stop falling from the sky. I think I was spending too much time building, bro. He ain't coming no more. I would just like to point out, I made this a complete chimney. Matter of fact, I got cobwebs. You could place these, right? Oh my God, look at that. There are no accidents, guys. Just happy little mistakes. Oh, we probably need these guys. Oh my God. Yo, relax, bro. Dude, I'm, I'm basically dead. Okay, we need to not die. We I think if we just hold on the wall, he can't get us. I think that's the play. Oh, he can? Nah, 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 nah. Sorry, buddy. Whoa, man. I'm about to die. Oh, dude. I need to get through these hearts. Come Go. On <laughs> Climb. Get him. Get him. 
Yo, I just realized the whole time I wasn't using my whip. I was acting like I was a summoner from back in the day, bro. All right, there we go. Oh my God. Ooh. Ooh. Yo. All right, I get to do time. All right, let's actually try to shoot him this time. Yo. Okay, okay. Grab the wall. Yo. Oh, oh. Okay, um, okay. And there we go. That was so easy. Now, for all you who think this isn't allowed, because it's not a jungle mount, just remember, in the rules, I didn't say mounts, okay? I'm using it. You didn't catch me, and I was making the rules. That That's your fault. What? All right, anyways, uh, we have to go kill the, the skeleton. Dude. All right, no arena. We're just going to see what happens. You want to fight me? Ooh. Yo. Ugh. Woo! Ugh. This dude's easy. It's oh! Oh! Yo, is the Dungeon Guardian, like, still active when I'm mid-boss fight? Ooh. There we go. Dude, we're just going through a boss rush right now. So, as you guys can see, it has been pretty easy for me so far. But things are about to get a little bit harder. Let me explain. With this gear, all the pretty hard mode bosses are pretty easy, honestly. I mean, as you just saw, I just destroyed them with, the, with no effort. <laughs> However, if you haven't already, I'm gonna ask you to think. What's the next jungle armor upgrade? The next one. After the B armor, what's the next one? Not the jungle armor. You guessed it. Chlorophyte armor. Meaning we have to defeat all three mech bosses with this gear right here. A wall of flesh, by the way. So if you're thinking right now this challenge is way too easy on classic mode, it's about to get a whole lot harder. Okay. Anyways, my point is we need to get some items to improve our setup right here. This is not the final setup. This whole slime mount jumping thing is cool. But we need to be able to jump a lot higher without switching to our mounts. So because of that, we're going to need some frog legs. Oh! I didn't think that would kill me. But yeah, frog legs can be fished up in the jungle. They're green. They're all froggy. Frogs spawn in the jungle. I definitely count it for the challenge. What? All right, for this next part, just take a step back and relax for this. I've been doing some high stimulating editing, some crazy editing. Let's take a step back and chill for a minute while I show you guys how I geared up. So we needed to fish, so I went to go get the jungle fishing rod, found it pretty quickly. But we didn't have any bait, so I went ahead and made a graveyard biome. Because maggot zombies spawn, and maggots, <clears throat> which have 22% bait power. So that was perfect. All you have to do is kill one of the zombies and just grab the maggots off of them. <laughs> as you oh, can three. see, I was enjoying myself. Then we collected more life crystals to improve our health, as we needed it for the harder bosses. But yeah, then I went fishing for these frog legs. Got them pretty quick, honestly. It was pretty lucky. Everything on the ground right there is all the stuff I had fished up. My inventory is completely full. But yeah, then we fought a quick goblin army, so we can get the goblin tinkerer, which is going to allow us to combine the frog legs with our shoe spot. I also caught a bunch of these uh, green fishes. That helped us make summoning potions, which increases our summon by one. We also went back to the dungeon and got the bewitching table, which also increases it by one. So now we were up to six minions, bro. Six minions pre-hard mode? Like, I didn't even think that was possible. Yeah, so we were pretty decked out, and uh, the next step was the wall of flesh. 